we noticed that there's this relationship that you have with uh, yeah. Miriam. Yeah. What is it about Miriam that makes you always reach out to her whenever you have a role for a child? Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I, I don't look at her as a child. I look at her as a performer. Yes. I, even child performer. I, yeah. <laughs> child performer. Yeah. But when I, even when I'm instructing her, when we're walking together, mm -hmm. I, I give her the instruction as an adult. Like, this is what you have to do. This is the motion you have to go through. And she interprets it properly. So for me, she's one of my best actors that I've worked with, you know, in this, this business. So out of all the movies you've done together, if you could think about your favorites, let's say pick two, the ones that you really like, that's, ah, this one, I enjoyed it with Uncle Imo. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, the first one would be Happiness Limited, because my first official movie, mm -hmm. and Uncle Imo is my first um, official director. So, and yeah, also it took me out of Lagos. It's the first official movie that took me out of Lagos. Lagos. Yeah. And, and the second one uh, is Children of Mud, which got me a nomination, uh, earned yeah. me a nomination at AMBCA 2018 in the category of the best actress. Yeah. Oh, shit. And that, I will never Just, forget it. We can't deny the fact that this is rare yeah, in Nigeria. Yeah, yeah. Why do you think we don't have as many child um, actors in Nigeria uh, in comparison to Hollywood? It's when we were, we were raised. Mm. Uh, as kids, we were raised to suppress our expression. You know, when you're a kid, when, when adults are talking, they, t they chase you out of the room. When you're trying to express yourself, they say you're stubborn. And mm. so kids just learn to suppress their expression yeah. until they become adults. Because performance is a lot, is a lot of expression. So it's 80% expressions. And so when you grow up in that kind of stifled environment, it's hard for you to come out. Yeah, and, just suppress and do that, something. That talent, yeah, yeah, and then yeah. perform. Yeah. For you, have you always wanted to be an actress or did you want to be a doctor at some point in your life or what? You know? Doctor, no, <laughs> at all. Okay, um, first of all, I didn't know I knew how to act. Mm. I didn't know acting was part of my talent. I. I didn't even think of it. So yeah. It was just one of the jobs I knew that ah, it, I like it. But did you want to be something else before? Before you discovered that ah, you could act? I didn't even think to that side. <laughs> but, um, Let me remind us. How old are you again? I'm 12 years old. Wow. <laughs> I wish I had this exposure at 12. <laughs> I wish a lot calmer now at 12 when she was 8. You know, she was more more vocal. <laughs> how many years has this uh, relationship been? Oh, going I mean, on? we made three films together. And How many years? Yeah, and it, for, in four years, oh, in four wow. five years, yeah, four and a half years, maybe. Mm. We made, yeah, we made three films together. And then for you, yeah. you always seem to go for the unique stories. <laughs> you don't go for regular stories. Let's talk about a project that for me was extremely ambitious. Yeah. You know, the yeah. Herbert Macaulay affair. <laughs> How? I mean, the thought of, of it alone is just, it, 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 it makes me weak in my mind trying to execute that. Yeah. So I can't imagine what you've gone through yeah. and you know, how did it all begin? What inspired that and how was the whole experience? I, I was part of the writing team for the 100 years anniversary documentary mm -hmm. for the country. Mm -hmm. And so while we were researching the characters in our history, I found out that there were lots of characters that we knew the names, but we didn't know the stories. Yeah. I've realized that documenting is a problem here. For me, my happiness is that for the first time, that, that grown-up people that realized how Macaulay was black. <laughs> he was a Nigerian. I'm one of them. <laughs> <laughs>